the 608 this morning, we have a preview of the Wisconsin State Fair, which is, believe it or not, only a week away. Wow, time flies. Josh Breider here now with more on what we can expect for 2022. Hey, Josh. Do I have Josh. any cream on my mouth, You're guys? looking good, buddy. I know, Leah, you are too deep already. <laughs> Do Just you have a two. third for me? Only two. Oh, my gosh, yeah. Tess, <laughs> Just Kurt's in with the Scott. She had to bring in the backups. Look I at this. I had to bring in the backups. That's right. Two <laughs> fresh boxes for you. Yeah, we devoured that six-pack like that. So. That's right. That's how it goes. Though. That's how it goes, especially when it comes to the original cream pie. Yes, which you can only get the 11 days of the Wisconsin State Fair in West Dallas. All right, so we are just a little over a week away, August 4th through the 14th this year. You know, a lot of new foods, not just the cream puffs to enjoy this year. Absolutely. We have nearly 80 new foods coming to the Wisconsin State Fair. That's just the wow. new foods alone. That 80? doesn't even, yes, that doesn't even count the corn dog, the funnel cake, all the classics that we have. That's just the brand new ones for this year. We have stuff like the gummy bear brat coming to the Wisconsin State Fair. That's a little bit interesting. That is interesting. So you'll have to see a little bit different than the cream puff, but also so many delicious items. We have a chicken, bacon, ranch, waffle, stick, gonna be amazing. Wow. Everyone's really excited about that one as well. So definitely go hungry. Absolutely go hungry and plan in advance so you can share those portions with people. So you've got the food, you've got the entertainment, and of course what we're really proud about here in Wisconsin is agriculture. Absolutely. Agriculture is the cornerstone of what we do at the Wisconsin State Fair and it's so important for people in more urban areas to see the more rural areas and see what the farming is like and where their food comes from as well. And this is pretty awesome to be able to celebrate a lot of the youth agriculture that we have around the state too and what some of our young folks are doing. Absolutely. It's it's the largest junior dairy show actually at the Wisconsin State Fair. So there's so many exhibitors showing their animals, but also showing things like their crafts and photography as well. So there's agriculture and competitive exhibits. So if folks are on a budget. There's a lot of actually unexpected free fun happening too at State Fair Park. There is. One of my favorite things to do is go to Exploratory Park, which is right near the Expo Center. There's a whole garden in there. Some just beautiful areas to relax a little bit, take a seat and just take in what the Wisconsin has to offer, the beautiful flowers, the beautiful foliage, things like that. So one, that's one of the free things. But of course, Saz is racing pigs presented by the Milwaukee Admirals as well. It's such a fun thing to take in and watch those pigs race as well. So a little bit of something for everyone, it sounds. Absolutely. There's always something for everyone at the Wisconsin State all Fair. All right, Tess, hit us with the details. <laughs> Head to WISTATEFAIR.COM for all those details and all those planning. But August 4th through August 14th in West Dallas, come, come and see us. It's going to be so much fun together. All right, Tess, thank you so much for thank being you. here. We appreciate it. And thanks for breakfast. <laughs> of course, anytime. Leah's pretty quiet over there. I think she's happy. As she said, let the pregnant woman eat. <laughs> That's the best quote. <laughs> Tess, thanks so much for thanks being so here. Me. Of course, we'll have all this up on channel3000.com. Kristen, look. I gotta be honest, after two, I'm feeling a little like I need a break. <laughs> Josh, thank you very much. You know I love a good meal at 6 in the morning. Always. Remember to let Josh know what inspires you in the 608. You know we love snacks. You can reach out to him on social media or shoot him an email for a chance to be featured.